All right, back to a couple things I forgot, or at least one thing I know I forgot. The tank itself needs to be, it should hand tighten. It should hand tighten to shut the gas line off. They tenant suggest you shut the gas off every time you store it. So you shut it off and let it run out on low. And then just run out the, the, the pressure in the line. I've been doing that, but it takes this thing a little bit of a pliers to fully clock, lock, uh, lock off the gas. So that's not ideal. It should come off of it by hand, but I'm not buying another tank. <coughs> um, uh, what else was there? Oh, I don't know if I said that this, when laying down, let me show you. I don't know if I did it or not. This thing, when laying down, is about a, maybe an eighth to a quarter inch off from there to here. And that can be adjusted. I was alone when I did that, and there's four bolts you need to loosen. And if you have two people, it's easy breezy, I would imagine, because I took it off with two. I had problems since. But uh, you've got all this stuff with the rhino liner. Um, I'm just going quickly back over it. I'm just trying to think. Oh, I didn't, I didn't run the uh, little vibrator thing, did I? Oh, let's see. It's got a little timer on it. You can hear it, and you can feel it. So it vibrates this thing. It's pretty neat. I don't know why I'm so excited by it, but it, it just runs it for a little bit, shakes out the dust from the uh, from the uh, brand new filter. Uh, hammer coated wheels, painted base coat, clear coat, speed hecker. Um, I painted high end cars for 20 years. You got my little emblem I put on there, and that's what I wanted to show you. If you look right here, and you can consult the manual one, and that'll do it two, one, two. That means no check engine, nothing's wrong. Like you can reset that by taking the pigtail and grounding it out from the computer. Make sure you let it run at least five minutes after being warm. Otherwise it won't, uh, it won't um, reset the idle properly. So I, it, it does it like it, I, I've reset it and then it comes back like three to four hour runtime later I think is when it's come back. But that's everything. I just wanted to go back over everything and make sure everything's covered. Um, I think that's it. You've got your tensioner for how, how tight or how hard your side brush goes on. And those are recently replaced. Um, man, I, this thing runs great. Um, once in a while, it'll poof when starting. I mean, I'll work on that a little bit to see. I'll talk, call tenant again tomorrow and see what they have for ideas, uh, the tech line. Uh, I've consulted them and the manual a lot. I'm, I'm, a, a, I'm ahead of a lot of the service for this thing. I mean, heck, look at this. Look, just look at it. The thing's beautiful. It's beautiful. The whole thing is absolutely fantastic. Um, there's nothing like this out there. So, short of just getting a new display for 179, I think it was. I mean, you're. I mean, even that. I mean, that's pretty dang good. But like the stickers look brand new. I mean, come buy this thing. Thank you.